Hello everyone, this is a fair to back with another deck review. This is the deck of robots deck. We'll be up alongside the bicycle robots from Penguin Magic. This one is my Stellar Factory. I'm not sure who did the artwork, unfortunately. It's pointed by USB-Cs. And basically it features one of Stellar Factory's remote facilities that is run by robots. And it features wacky but functional robots. It's all about robots. Kind of just rolled my R. <laughs> I never do that. Star Factory deck of robots on the front there and playing cards 52 as well. It's a standard USB C tuck case. This deck of robots. An S for Stellar on the side, same with the other side. Some artwork circuitry on top. Add copy on the bottom. That's where you can get it StellarFactory.com. Let's hit them out. And apparently, this is robot sealed by robot 347. <laughs> It says Deck of Robots takes you to a top secret Stellar Factory facility run by robots. Each face card features a different robot working, testing games, printing cards, and more. You'll find binary code and schematic like designs throughout the rest of the deck. These poker sized playing cards are printed on casino quality paper made in the USA. StellarFactory.com. Nice custom seal as you saw. Just a standard tuck case. It says beep boop <laughs> on the flap and some stars. And there's some ad card. There's an ad card here for Space Team. It's a card game of some sort. And here we go. Oh, it says art. Uh, it says here it's illustrated by Untitled Ebro. I just forgot to add that to my information. Art and product is written by Matthew Sisson. So yeah. And there's the back design. Actually, it's not the back design. <laughs> well, it is, but it isn't. It's an orange color. It's you can use it as a gaff card. Color changing the actual back design is black and white, as you would expect. I think the Joker's nice robots making pizza. Apparently, this one pretty nice. They remind me a lot of like the Jetsons. If you ever watched that cartoon back in the day, nice custom aces, kind of an orangey color for the hearts and diamonds. Gray is almost for the spades and clubs. It's interesting that the, the Ace of Diamonds for some reason has suit indicator pips while the other Aces do not. I feel like that's a screw up. Maybe they were going to do that and then they changed their mind but they've forgotten one card. I don't know. What the heck Stella Factory? Your machine's making mistakes. <laughs> the robot's goofed. I guess but nice cold cards. With robots of course. Well, you guessed that I ran out of memory space, but I'm back. I think this is where we're about to left off with the last court card. Definitely reminds me of the Jetsons. <laughs> nice number of cards. And yeah, pretty cool. It's printed by USB-C, as I mentioned. Casino quality stock. Uh, air custom wood and finish. Aside from one minor goof on the Ace of Diamonds, it handles nice and it's completely custom, unique and original. It doesn't have a, a, a nice tuck case like, you know, say, Art of Play. But, unlike Art of Play, they want the extra mile with the artwork on the card. So, thumbs up for that. I will give this one a plus. I like it. Comment, rate, subscribe. Let me know what you think. And we'll see you next time for more. Thanks for watching.